Art for me is an act of worship. It is a gift from God. The artistic process is meditation. The final product represents the manifestation of the gift which can be shared with humanity. The path of an artist is a journey, a pilgrimage. Each stroke of the brush is like an act of faith. Confidence in something believed but not yet seen. The sharing with others is like an offering. It is the planting of seeds. Art is necessary, like breathing. It gives as well as sustains life. In this way, it becomes divine. As the journey unfolds, the art evolves. The rainbow colors in my work represent the spirit of God and his covenant with humanity to preserve our souls. The rainbows come after rainstorms. For the believer, this is the anchor of the soul. It is the essence of life which propels us forward. It is evidence that we must allow ourselves a space to dream. The blues represent the heavens, the expansive nature of the sky, the possibility of dreams, the baptism. They have emerged in swirls, a universal symbol echoing the light of Christ, the presence of the Holy Spirit, the hope of the future. The butterflies have always been symbolic of the change and transformation that are inevitable in our lives. They speak to the presence of earth angels sent to help us become our best selves. Ultimately, butterflies are a gentle reminder of the fragility of our existence and the fleeting moments that represent a lifetime. This painting is called Light from Heaven, and I tell people it is myself and President-elect Barack Obama running for president, because I was so struck by President Obama and his ability to reach you as an individual and empower you to feel like your individual efforts could make a difference in our country and in the world. And so I wanted to paint um, Obama in a way that uh, would, you know, very personal, very much in the style of the way that I paint my other paintings. So it is actually called Light from Heaven because he emulates that to me um, with the swirls, you know, the presence of God, you could tell he's a higher power. But as I was painting the painting, I painted it, I finished it, and then I was looking at it again, so I started working on it. And I looked up at a certain point and I felt like, oh my goodness, I had painted myself, you know, running for president. And when I thought about it, um, after I, you know, painted over it again, it felt very relevant because um, Barack Obama made you feel as an individual that you could do something that your efforts would make a change or you know, that you could be empowered to be the very best you and make the world a better place. And so I'm excited about, you know, I'm excited about the work. I'm excited about the first African-American president of the United States of America to see it, you know, during my lifetime and excited about the possibilities. Did you think that it would happen in our lifetime? Was it just hope, or did you actually believe that somebody, maybe a few years ago, Sharpton might finally pick it up again and try to do it? Or I mean, I definitely felt something? like it was possible. You know, I think even with President Obama, like you're concerned about um, his safety, you know, safety of his family. But I think if you're like really walking with God, then you're not moving in fear. You know, you're moving in faith and you're moving in love, and He embodies that you know so I think um, that's the strength you know coming from the inside that's so much larger you know, makes it seem so make, makes him seem larger than life you know because it's not just him and even when he's talking or you know he it's never really about him it's about him with other people and I'm putting good people around him and, and lifting up and empowering other people which is so much about what his campaign is about, you know, which is what we need here, because the face of the world is changing, you know, so I think it just kind of knocked down the door of the realm of possibilities because his campaign was run even in a way with like the digital age and, you know, technology and the internet. Uh, I still get emails, you know, from his campaign. You're just kind of waiting, okay, well, what can I do Know, what's next and so yeah I definitely felt like it could happen in our lifetime and I'm proud you know I'm proud of America that 
so many people kind of stood up and did their part to bring about something very different, you know, to open up the doors to so many other people to make the world better. And that's really what it's about. Not just America, it's about making, you know, it's about making the world better.